never get to see it. They'll never continue Andromeda. Those goddamn bastards and Bioware and EA. Mostly EA. Welcome back, everyone, to another episode of Mass Effect Andromeda. That's right, we are back. In today's episode, we're gonna investigate the Ket base. Yes. I think I did a bit of... I did a bit of research, but also still confused the shit out of me, as I do not remember what that other... A trail of hope. Meet the resistance on Vold. Huh. Anyway, yeah, uh... We'll just do this. We'll see what happens. I wonder if we just go straight into actual main mission, though, because I thought this was just a side quest. So let's all sit back, relax, and enjoy today's episode. Yep. We're last where we were, which was a uh, bat cat. Um, not face, but uh, uh oh, gotta go down this way. More like an outpost. Yeah, get an outpost. So I'm a bit more enthusiastic, more energy. Uh huh. Did we clean up that cat camp? Damn. Yes. Well, it's cutting right through my suit. But it provides cover for the resistance. And the cold doesn't bother us. Oh my god, crap, I'm out of ammo. I need more. <laughs> nice try. Yeah, swap over. I haven't pulled out my machine gun in a while. Crap, my life support is low. I gotta get back in. Keep an eye on your temperature sensors. Yep. Crap, that did nothing. I think that's it. No, it's not. There we go. Get ourselves into a heat zone. No! Oh my god! There are no heat zones here. No one will be there! Keep an eye on your temperature sensors. Shielding back up. People say you can get anything. They do say that, don't Cabins. they? Oh. By the way you're looking up. at me, I take it you want something. Well, the resistance is always in need of equipment. I'm sure there's something we can trade. We can talk about it more. Keep an eye on your temperature sensors. Yep. There is a heating area right there. Hostiles ahead! Get your gun out! Eat. Life support levels are critically low. No, they're not anymore. can refill on ammo. Crap, there wasn't. Damn. I should have stocked up before I came Keep an eye on your temperature sensors. Oh my god, we know, Ryder. Shut up! Oh, my god. oh, that's why I drove it into these guys. There we are. Woohoo! Now, I also noticed... What the hell is this? Keep an eye on your temperature sensors. Temperature sensors. Thank God, Ryder just gonna keep saying that, isn't he? Oh, 
Systems are failing. Oh my God. Failure. No! This is annoying. Just sit here and wait for it to go back up. There we go. Got it. I don't even know what the hell I just did. I hope the Angara. Keep an eye on your temperature sensors. Oh my God. This area is a shit storm. Oh, place where we can have a drop pod. Yes. Oh my God. Wow. Nice. Activating automated forward station deployment. Forward station that puts it. That's you are so oh. bold on the battlefield. Yet light on your feet. <laughs> like a dance. <laughs> you pick up a lot of skills working the angles. Yeah, I've been known to tango now and then. That's a steep drop rider. Relax, I got this. Yes. I have always liked bold. It is harsh, but beautiful. Outside temperature is in free fall. Uh huh, there is a thing where you can warm up. Oh, uh, yes. Thank God. And there are enemies here. And I am out of ammo. Explore this area. Oh, this is... We were too late. Oh no. Medical cash. Oh. Oh. One down, two to go. Huh. Didn't realize that that was a mission. Approaching a resistance emergency medical cash pathfinder. Oh, you're ready. Damn, Sam is slow. Maybe an AI, but he's just too damn slow. <laughs> Oi, can't shield back up.
Voxel, I'm at the entrance to the base. Have you decrypted the code for the shields? Yes, and not a moment too soon. Transferring it to you now. Stars be bright for you, Pathfinder. Okay. Ah. I'm guessing this facility is different to the main facility that they are talking about, right? Right? I'm hoping. Ah. <laughs> oh. Uh -huh. Here we go. We're in. Time to get to work. Yes, and do we have a special map for this? Oh, no, we don't. Oh, okay. Let's just look around now. Investigate. Excellent <laughs> shot. Excellent shot indeed. Hey, got one more up there. Nice. Oh. Nice work. I can identify them now, those sneaky bastards. saying that, don't I? Here we go. Yep. Nice. It's all that I say in this series. <laughs> Other than additional info here and there. Hey. Wow. <laughs> I count as cheating. I just don't Watch seem out. to know I'm here yet. Bastard. Or something. This appears to be a cat secure storage building. The entry is locked out by defense Ooh. matrix. Damn, whatever they're protecting must be important. We should find that defense matrix and shut it down. Mm -hmm. Yes. The command base is just ahead. I know it's already pretty cold here, but stay extra frosty. Pathfinder, <laughs> I recommend you head toward the primary tower. It appears to be the core of the base. Nice work. Nice work indeed. Nice 
one up here. Nope, they're all up. access to the Kent Tower. The terminal is protected by a force field. I have all the location of the three oh, Kent generators that power the force field. Disabling all the generators will allow you to shut down the security terminal. Okay. Where are these? Oh. Where are these generators? Oh, they're now appearing on the map. One generator down. Terminal. Destroy it to unlock access to the Kent Tower. ourselves at the goddamn tours up here. Turret. Hey. Let's destroy those shields. The security Whoa. terminal has been destroyed. It's been too close. To
I just non stop up these people? Oh! Oh, so. Got you. We got you. Hey. down by identifying and destroying critical subsystems. Oh Pathfinder, I recommend using your scanner to identify the critical systems. Be careful, destruction of non-critical systems will create hazards. <laughs> So I haven't died yet. Nice. <laughs> Though, after I've just said that, that's probably gonna bite me in the ass. Okay, yeah, I'm guessing this cat facility here is completely different to the main mission cat facility with the Moshe is hidden. It appears each of the hangar platforms has oh, an automated nice. fueling system. If you can access the controls, I can overload the system. I don't, 
call uh Yeah, there you are. Now just to take out these landing platforms, right? Nothing to do with scanning. Okay, okay, can do. Damn, the controls are locked. Pathfinder, I have located several override terminals in the vicinity. Okay, overriding. Just scanning around. No, not scanning around, but uh, just getting all these loot. Get this loot. Damn, that's a view. What was it? I can't see. It's so bright. <laughs> anyway, uh, yeah. Let's Alarms do this. Disabled, Pathfinder. Oh, no. Nice. Yeah, I haven't done any of those cryo stuff in a while. <laughs> I haven't been on the Tempest as well for a while. Woohoo! We've done it! Now off to... Oh! Oh! Hey! Damn! 
We tried to take down this place for months, and you made it look so easy. Destroying their command structure and system just leaves the rest of the kept vulnerable. <coughs> Remember Jarnik? The shield around it's come down. Ooh. The frozen city? That's the one. This is the perfect opportunity for a final push while they're still dealing with the chaos. Nice. So... Yeah, Tell me about this ancient city. Yeah. They say it was abandoned when the scourge hit. The cold came and it was trapped in ice. The Ket learned we were investigating and took it. They think they can plunder it for remnant secrets. <gasps> Let's hope they haven't completely destroyed everything. Okay, yeah, come on. Let's go and fight. I'll deal with it. In nice. the meantime, I'll see if there's anything I can find here. Be careful, Ryder. <laughs> so I'm uh, supposed to... Oh, it just means I'll stay here? I see an ice cave, yeah. Really, just not <laughs> strange. Strange indeed. Cave. Yeah, investigate the ice cave. All right, then I guess I'll just head to this forward station first and see if I can talk with people. Be right back. All right, stuff that you guys can read, and I to just click at. <laughs> My back's killing me. Huh, so there is uh, like a quest giver up here. I was looking for one. And uh, hello, merchant. I'd like to sell all my salvage. There you go. Nice. Your coward. Calls on the side and be run out of town. Oh, Svanha. Hello. You're the human who came from Aya. Is it still beautiful there? Absolutely. The most beautiful world I've seen in the cluster, by a long shot. I miss it terribly. Aww. I was born there, spent my childhood in warm air and sunlight. I'll never forget how that felt. Oh. Uh, you plan on returning? Why don't you go back? Yeah. My life, family, livelihood, they're all here. Okay, what well, stuff do you have? What do you sell? Mm -hmm. I trade with those who have things they don't need anymore, but who need things I have. <laughs> Small comforts. Nothing of value to you. Okay. What's a small comfort on board? Clothing, tools, art, toys. Anything to remind them of happier times. Things they can hold in the dark. Okay. What do you mean, people with things they don't need? Refugees carrying whatever they grabbed as they fled. Oh. The lighter their load, the easier their journey. I pay well. Damn. All right. Thanks. Thanks, Thanks for, for talking. Talk. With me. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you for reminding me of Aya. Oh, nice. Now to the quest giver. This just, this just reminds me of Hoth in Star Wars. Oh. Oh. Why are you hiding right here? A human. All the way out here. You must have guts. <laughs> if anyone can help my people, it's you. Nice. Help with what? The cat destroyed a dar not far from here. Retaliation after the resistance pushed them out. The people were either killed or driven off. They left everything behind. The cat will pay. I'll make those monsters pay for what they did to your people. Which we appreciate. But I need your help with something else. Oh. I'm a historian. Ooh. That Dar was home to a priceless Angaran artifact. A map of ancient fold. I sent two of my colleagues to retrieve it, but they run into trouble out there. The Ket came back to finish the job. I need someone to help my people fight their way out. You can count on me. Don't worry. I'll dig them out of trouble. You're a lifesaver. I'll give you the nav point for the Dar. Please hurry. Nice, cool. Obtain a new quest. Are there any more quests givers here? Nope. Nothing that I can see. But uh, I guess for now. Let's go and do more of this stuff. Like uh, investigating the ice cave or not trap uh, tracking the poachers. I could. I could. Or also the periphony. The periphone. Periphona. 
reading it completely wrong. <laughs> Let's do that. So, we'll be right back to places where we're supposed to actually be, rather than just a reflection of the ice or minerals. I've been reading about the Krogan rebellions from your history. Go on. Your friendship with Drag isn't typical of krogan Turian relations. I'll take that as a compliment. He can be a cranky old bastard. I think you know that's not where I was going with this. Oh. What? About to say like it's more of a father daughter type. That's Drak. He's literally the dad. He's cool. <laughs> Is that it? Another damn reflection. Still getting the periphonus signal. Guess she's grounded. Maybe they decided to stay put. Maybe. I and many others have never known a world without Ket. The Resistance fights so our children may one day be free. They're a tough bunch. Yes. This is the source of the Periphonus signal. <gasps> and only wreckage. And there's Cat on sight. Let's clear them out. Thing over here. Flight recorder. That's the periphone, all right. What's left of her? <gasps> Cora should see this. Okay, call her in. Look at this, Cora. You came out of nowhere. Definitely Ket weapons fire. This wasn't just a crash. The Ket pulverized the ship. No survivors. Bastards. If we'd have been faster, we could have. Why is my. Why is it blinking? But. This is stupid. The cat take prisoners. Why kill the crew? Uh, why? Why are you blinking? Can't our monsters? Maybe they saw a helpless target and couldn't resist. Hey, got something here. Looks like the flight recorder made it. Nice. It's in bad shape. But let's see what... Final log. If the Ark ever finds this, we failed. Couldn't draw them off. The data copy's lost. The decimation's too cunning. 
forgive us. We tried. The decimation. Hadaria mentioned specialized cat hunters. Maybe that's them. Yes. Any way we could use that or the flight recorder to find the Ark? If the nav record survived, we could trace the Periphonus flight path. Might lead us to them. Perfect. I can't assist. I'll get started. See you back at the Tempest. Nice. Nice. I remember that one hold. Okay. Guess it's off to now. Uh... Also, look at this ice cave. As... Yeah, damn, there is actually a whole bunch of other stuff that we can do. Then there's also a fine outpost site, which I also think is something we can do. Nice, let's... let's do that instead. Nope. Be right back, fast traveling to the fastest forward station, also checking to see how much time we've done so far. Alright, I've done just 43 minutes, that is good. Let's now head over to the uh, outpost site. Petra, I catch PB looking at me. Frequently. PB <laughs> likes new shiny things. Uh, and why not? You're genuinely interesting. This site is viable for an initiative outpost pathfinder. Oh my god. Bastards. Let me reach 40% viability. Also, yeah, my uh, nomad is smoking. Yeah, ran through some cat. Stupid of me. But, uh, hey! Hey! Uh, memory trigger? Nice. Another memory trigger? One of your father's memories is now accessible. Return nice. to Samnode on the Hyperion to investigate further. Can do that. So, hey. Here we go. Initiate outpost. Confirm. Congratulations, Pathfinder. We need extra heat this was a real facility. challenge. Get an order and badly made it. Director Addison, no personal appearance? Placing an outpost is a big deal. Thank you, but no. I prefer climate control to these extremes. <laughs> Real talk, Pathfinder. I, as Governor Shy, is already up my ass about this outpost. If local Angara weren't on board, we'd have a problem. Oh. We are good, right? As much as you brought us, we can't afford to anger the neighbors. They want us as allies. Procedure was followed, as I invented it. Don't worry, we were invited. Good. We need every drop of viability. Especially on right? this kept facility. <laughs> Vold helps. Cold as it is, it changes estimates in our favor. But the initiative needs you to find more. Okay. We're never really done, of course. Survival isn't something that just... ends. And there's another matter. A ceremonial one. A statement for the archives. Is this really the time? Pathfinder was always a symbol. Like outpost flags hanging in the commons, the people need a connection to reality on the ground. Address them, Pathfinder. What did this mean? This is an ongoing adventure. You need to see this place. I've laid the groundwork, but there's so much left to discover. Vold <laughs> is not just about survival. We know it. The Angara know it. It's the adventure we all signed on for. Recorded, Pathfinder. Add us now. Nice. Nice. Okay, cool. We're now in human colony areas. Sent Telesso on another run. No, wait. It's with this a person I can just talk to? Oh. Third time this week. Send someone else. Uh, hello. Pleasure to meet you, Pathfinder. Priya Blake, Captain of Outpost Taravuni. Nice. I'm glad you're here. I thought we'd have to deal with this on our own. What's the problem? Is it the cat? No. At least I don't think so. A few of my drill technicians went missing on a research expedition west of here. Oh, oh no. We've tried their comms, but get nothing but static. They're in trouble. Whatever happened, they're not safe out there. We need to find them. Mm -hmm. We're not equipped for a full search, especially into dangerous territory. I don't me? know what to do. I was supposed to keep these people safe. I've already failed them. I'll find them. Don't lose hope. I'll find your people. Yes. Coming from you, I believe it. Their research log is in the lab. Maybe your AI can piece together the corrupted data and get a nav point. Nice. And I guess, yes, let's talk about this. And mm -hmm. I could maybe end the video. I have to say, I'm surprised <laughs> the Angara let us put an outpost here. A portion of the ice we mine goes to their blockade runners, who take it to resistance bases all over the cluster. Nice. Water for their soldiers. It feels good to do our part against the Ket, however small. 
Nice. Outpost and Vold. We're staking a claim, but what does the initiative want with Vold? Look at the landscape. What do you see? Ice. A lot of ice. <laughs> Water. Vold is a massive, endless source of it. We're proud to serve as the initiative's first ice runners. We mine the ice here and haul it to colonies where water is scarce. Nice. Like Eos. Mm -hmm. Even the Nexus. The more people we wake from cryo, the more resources we'll need. Our ice runners make sure water is never a problem. Cool. Uh, what's that? You picked a mouthful of a name for the outpost. <laughs> it's Shalesh. And Garan language means forward together. It nice. represents the close relationship we have with the Angara here in Bold. Glad to hear you're working together. This is their world. Because of you, they trusted us enough to give us a place in it. Now it's my job to cement that bond. We'll do our best to earn what they've given us. Nice. Uh, Prayer Blink. Were you in the Alliance too? Mm -hmm. I was an Alliance officer for a decade before I got sick of being a pawn in the Council's power plays. <laughs> Heard about the initiative and figured it'd be a fresh start. A chance to make a real difference. I'm ex-Alliance too. You ever miss it? Given the chance, I'd make this choice all over again. But when I see the resistance push against the cat, makes me wonder if my days behind a gun aren't really over. Hmm. Interesting. Well, anyway, that's I all. I should head out. Come back if you need anything. Yeah, and uh, I'd like to explore more of the area. Okay, I got one for you. Here to Elodin, three hours and forty-two minutes. Oh. Cute. Don't tell me. Three hours, eighteen minutes. <sighs> okay, what's this? What's going on here? So I get to meet the Pathfinder responsible for making this place happen. I'm Lizanna Telesso. Because of you, I have the best job in the galaxy. Which is? I'm an ice runner. I get to dodge the scourge and outrun the cat to bring water to the colonies. Mm -hmm. Doesn't get more exciting than that. Nice. Sounds like fun. Facing danger to make everyone's life better. No wonder you love it. <laughs> when you put it that way. Your job isn't too different. Yes, now, let us talk. How did you get into you. this job? Yes. I was a pilot for the Citadel fleet. Until I got bored and wanted something new. Mm -hmm. The initiative sounded right up my alley. I was one of the first to sign up. But how'd you end up at this outpost? I asked. Marched into Priya's office and told her I was the best pilot she'd get. <laughs> Said I didn't care if the outpost was mostly ex-alliance. I wanted in. I've been giving her trouble ever since. <laughs> Alright, tell me about ice running. So you mine the ice as a water source. Smart. Mm -hmm. I fly ice blocks to the Nexus. Eos. Even made a run to Havarl for the Angara. Nice. Speaking of which, it sounded like there was trouble brewing when I landed. The Angara were on edge. Maybe you should check it out. Uh, yes. I've not finished the whole I've flown through the scourge before. situation here yet. It's not easy. That's half the fun. I get to change my routes to avoid it. Like I'm outsmarting it. <laughs> I've had a few close calls where it shorted my nav system. Once, I flew blind all the way to the Nexus. There's no way you pulled that off. There's a reason I was the Citadel's best pilot. <laughs> well, cool. See you around. Take it easy. Yes. No fun in that. <laughs> Alright, what else is around this place? It is cool exploring our new colonies. Oh, cool. Research center. Oh, I didn't know that. Okay. Who else may I? Oh, what's this? Oh, <gasps> Turin frigate model. Oh my god. Have I been missing out on these? How far did the drill techs have to dig? Already 30 meters deep. No temperature change. This damn ice model. Uh, hello, person. Pathfinder, welcome to Scenic Vold. Hope you're enjoying the view. To the east, oh. ice. The west, more ice. <laughs> Look on the bright side. At least you're not in cryo anymore, right? <laughs> Look around. This is cryo. <laughs> but I'll endure this frozen hell if it means completing my research. Okay. Uh, I'm guessing it's about the vault's weather. You know, it was even worse here before what? I activated the vault. So I heard. Glad I wasn't around for that. Makes me wonder what this place will look like in ten years, once the vault's had time to really work. Think it'll be up to your standards? My standards involve a beach and a healthy amount of sun, but we'll see. <laughs> hate it when they come up with conversations like that. Oh, I wonder what this planet's gonna be like in ten years. 
never get to see it. It'll never continue Andromeda. Those goddamn bastards and Bioware and EA. Mostly EA bastards. What are you researching? Mm -hmm. I'm studying ways we can harness geothermal activity as a source of energy. Uh, Believe it or not, below Vold's surface is a maze of heated geothermal vents. Ooh. Keeps the planet from oh. becoming completely inhospitable, but just barely. And you can use it as a power source. Nice. That's the hope. I hear the Angara are doing something similar, but they won't let me get close. <laughs> so I'm determined to find the solution on my own. Okay, cool. I'm good for now. Yep. Don't freeze to death out there. <laughs> I hope. Now it's time to see the outside of the colony. Oh! <laughs> Still on fire. Looks like we got some Angaran guards out here. Guy over here. Right? Right? Yeah, it is an Angaran guard. Nice. Alright, what's this side? I mean, what's in here? Ooh, it's so bright in here. Hey, well, you can get me a few extra. Oh. Here's our Pathfinder. Captain Blake says you're welcome to any tech in my stock. Nice! By the way, I saw your Nomad earlier. How does that thing handle? It does its job. It keeps the cat off me. That's yeah. all I can ask for. Fair point. Still, I bet it's fun to drive. Anyway, I have new tech in stock. See if anything strikes your interest. Oh, oh, cool. Uh, I see I sell my salvage. There you go. Yes. And, uh, hello, person. It's you. Bennett Kahale reporting for duty. You need supplies? I'm your man. It's an <laughs> honor to meet you, Pathfinder. Uh, relax. This isn't the Alliance. No need for formalities. Just call me Ryder. Sorry. Old habits die hard when Captain Blake barks orders like a drill sergeant. <laughs> Captain Blake? Not an official title, of course. She earned the nickname because she runs this place like an alliance camp. But I jabbered away for too long. You're here for supplies. Well, Let's see what you have. Uh, Whatever you well, need, really, I've got but... it. Sure. Okay, cool. Got stuff. Anything else around here? Nope. Off to the outside again. That is never Already in here. There's another building across from us, or uh, like a small one. What's in here? And I think did I I see turrets. Yeah, damn. Whoa. Petra. <laughs> oh, it's like a little uh well like a dormitory, I guess you could say. Though it's supposed to be someone's house. I like seeing that. Seeing that it's turned into something else when it should have been something else. <laughs> oh. What the hell? What's this? What's this? What am I looking for? Hmm? Huh? It's a pad? Oh! That's right, we're searching for people. Huh. Yeah, I forgot about that. Sam, you get anything from this mask? Analyzing. It seems most of their data comes from a single nav point. Updating now. Let's okay. hope there's something left of them to find. Mm -hmm. I'll see that later, though. Another area of just uh, a makeshift HAP unit, even though these are kind of HAP units. It's just not fully turned into a HAP unit because it's got it's all messy and unorganized and stuff like that. Oh, I love the design. As I said, I am uh, learning how to do Blender and stuff like that after getting inspired by seeing someone else's Blender stuff. But I'd like to do that. Whoa, damn, got a bunch of stuff. Okay, so that's us exploring the area already done. Nice. Um, I'll stand here, right in front of our burning... <laughs> right in front of our burning, what do you call it? Nomad. This is where I'm ending today's episode. Hope you all enjoyed. The next, we are investigating sites and maybe rescuing the Moshai, finally. So thank you all for watching and goodbye for now. Alt F9 and off.